What's going on guys, it's your boy D, welcome back to another video, and today guys, I have some leaks founded by iLoot Games, if you don't know who iLoot Games is, he's a data miner for Apex Legends, he's the one who found this out in the first place, so make sure you guys go check him out, he does great videos, great content, he does a lot of leaks, a lot of news videos, so make sure you check him out, but anyways, let's get right into the news here. Coming to Apex Legends, we're going to have new passive abilities passed down to each category of Legends. For defensive Legends like Caustic, Gibraltar, and Watson, they can res their teammates and give them shields as they res them. I don't know if they're going to give you 100% of shields back. I don't know if they're going to give you 25% shields back. I'm not sure how much. Hopefully, it's just like 50 or 75. I'm not trying to go at somebody who's literally at... 75 shields and 30 health when they just got res that's so fucking annoying that kind of defeats the purpose of a gold backpack but i don't know how exactly that's gonna work i feel like that's already really op because gibraltar already reses faster in the bubble and he already is so op as he is and now you're giving him another passive on top of every fucking passive he has it's ridiculous how much they're buffing gibraltar i don't know hopefully they nerf him and then they add this on because if they have this on top of gibraltar like bro that's super ridiculous but with the next one I have here, this one's kind of trash, I'm not going to lie. For assault characters, they will have extra slots for grenades. So now you guys realize why they took down the grenade amount that you have in a stack. It's for the next update so that way the assault players can have extra grenades, which is honestly, like I said, really bad. This is terrible. Like, why would I want extra grenades for? Sometimes I don't ever use grenades. But that's my personal opinion. I feel like a good passive ability to add to assault players would be like, I don't know, faster reload time. That'll be kind of sick or something like that. I don't know. But like adding an extra grenade honestly sucks. I think that's terrible. It's so stupid. But anyways, we're going to move on to the next one. All recon legends will now be able to use Pathfinder's passive ability. Now, basically, Crypto, Bloodhound, Pathfinder, all three of them can use the recon beacons and see the next ring. I don't know if they're going to change Pathfinder's original passive and just you know add something different for him or they're just gonna i don't know i don't know how they're gonna deal with pathfinder hopefully they give him a different passive now but we'll see how that goes i kind of don't like this one either but all these leagues are subject to change later on but anyways the last one i have for you guys here is for the support characters all support characters will have blue supply bins around the map where they can only open and they will give you extra supplies so they're basically like little mini I guess supply drops in a way, but they're just in bins, I guess. I guess they'll give you pretty good loot, I guess. Hopefully it does. Um, the new legend that will come out will be Loba, which will be a support character. So, Lifeline, Loba, it's both support characters, and they both can open these blue bins, which would be really nice. I think that's a pretty cool little buff you can give to the support characters, but that's all I have for you guys today. I honestly think some of these are really bad. Like the grenade ones for the assault players, I think that's just trash. Um, the the resing with shields, I think is really cool, but personally, I feel like it's a little too much. But I don't know. I think it's kind of cool. Hopefully, they just don't give you like a hundred shields off of res. Hopefully, they just give you like maybe like fifty shields. That'd be kind of cool. But anyways, guys, let me know how you felt about this video down in the comment section below. Leave me a like to let me know that you enjoyed. If you're brand new to the channel, please subscribe. I make videos like this on the weekly and I live stream on the weekly as well. Anyways, guys, I'll catch you guys on the next one. See ya.